What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Nay Marie or Nay for short, and I'm back with another video. Okay, so y'all see my hair? Like, <laughs> yes, <laughs> silk press season. This is my favorite season. So. I'm about, well, Araya's in the back. Y'all can't see. Let me see. So, we about to go get my sister from her college. And then, I'm going to Walmart to go get some school supplies. I gotta tell y'all a lot. And then, um, I think that's it. But, this video today is mainly about what, uh what's going on in my life and what's different what's new i can't wait to put y'all on but yeah we about to get into that in a few all right so y'all probably like school supplies what you getting school supplies for for Araya? no it's for me your girl is going back to school now i'm attending this nine month program for nursing you know, because now is about that time where I want more money, better benefits, and I just need something that's... Sorry, because it's like everybody acting a little, a little retarded today. Um, I just want a better life, and I want a career. So, this might just be my whole new journey. Not this might. This is going to be my new journey. And I'm excited to do it. Like, I know y'all probably like, bro, like, you weren't just talking about nursing your last couple of videos. Well, you see, me and my man was talking one day. And he was just like, you know, he's about to get into a better job with better money, better benefits and all of that. So, you know, of course, he want to take care of me and his daughter. But he was just like... You know, if I'm up, my girl got to be up too, which I can understand because I like having my own money anyway. Ooh, but, um, yeah, once we was having a conversation about that, it was just like, you know what, he right. And it's like, y'all know I do security as my job. And honestly, if anybody know, you know, security is not bringing in no type of money at all. Like. I'm getting paid fifteen fifty a week. Imagine how my paycheck is every week. And then on top of that, like, I, I, it's hard for me to save money now because I can't. Because I have bills to pay. Like, and it's just like, every time I pay a bill, it's a whole new bill that's being due. And it's like, well then, I don't have no money to myself anymore. And anybody that know me, I like to get my nails done, I like to get my hair done. I like to take care of myself. I like to buy myself clothes. I ain't do that in a couple of months due to the fact that I just haven't had the money to do those things. So now that I'm I'm trying to get myself in a in a predicament where I'm able to still spend money on a riot and still have money left to um mouth drop. Still got money left to um you know save and pay bills and all this stuff so because i didn't think my bills is going to come first before anything but anyway the program love it i toured the school and everything like um it's a whole vibe teachers nice classroom small intimate not too big not too many people just the way i like it and then if i need the help you know they're there to help me and stuff so that's another thing the program they seem so dedicated into helping out the students and wanting you to pass and graduate and you know that's a step right there like that's something for me that shows that they really care which i love so um i uh i actually start school monday now this is the killer thing y'all going to school and I'm going to work 
y'all already know I'm about to be tired. But it's going to be worth it because I'm going to keep grinding and pushing myself. Because I'm not only am I doing this for me, but I'm doing this for my daughter too. But this is how my whole schedule is going to be. So my classes is from Monday Monday to Thursday. 9, nine o'clock to 3 o'clock. So y'all know I take a ride to school around like 8 o'clock. Um, I think I'm going to have to start waking up a little bit more earlier because I usually wake up at 7.30, you know, get her ready and done. We'll be done by like 8 something, take her to school. And then on Mondays and Tuesdays, I usually don't have work until 4 o'clock. So I'm able to stay in the house and sleep until like 2.40 something or whatever because my job is a little far. But since I'm going to school now, so the thing is going to be I'll probably wake up at 7.00. Um, get Araya dressed because her school open up at 7.30. Probably get her to school by 7.30. Um, then uh, I already have my stuff with me because I can't come back home because my class start at 9. So from her school, I just go to my school and then do my classes. And then from my school, I just go to my job. So I got to make sure on Mondays and Tuesdays, I carry my work clothes with me in my car. That way I could just get dressed at my job. You feel me? Um, that, that seems, it seems like a lot, but I know I could do it. And it's like I said, all of that is just going to pay off in the end because you know, I want to see myself in that cap and gown. This is for the people who thought I wasn't going to go back to school, even though I kept saying, yes, I was going to go back to school. I just didn't know what I was going to go back to school for. Because if y'all know, when I went to when I went to college, I went to Berkeley at first. And I went for arts because I used to draw. That used to be my passion. I stopped drawing and I realized art wasn't really my passion. So I left Berkeley, went to Willie P. Went to Willie P for business, and I realized that wasn't really my passion. Like, it was cool up until the math part, and I'm like, yo, me and math, we don't, we don't come together. So, and then stuff happened that I had to drop out of college, and of course, Araya wasn't born yet, so some personal stuff happened, and I had to drop out of college, so... I just been home since like I have not attended no school I tried to do uh, excess county but um, uh, unfortunately that plan went down the drain because of Willie P because I had to owe them uh, the the loans I had to pay the money back in order to get back to a different go to a different school so I put just put school on the back burner but I knew I was gonna go back to school I just didn't know what I was gonna go back to school for so now that my man helped me like figure out what it is I want to do and like what can help me in life and benefit me and everything it's like you know kudos to him you feel me like ain't nothing uh, ain't nothing too good is when somebody when you have somebody by your side that's like uplifting you and like see more in you than you see in yourself like of course I didn't think that I was going be working for security my whole life. Cause who? Who? Not I. But I had to figure out what is it I wanted to do in life. But you know, I found out nursing is kind of cool. Cause not only that, like my family background comes from nursing, especially with my mom. So that's why I know I know enough about nursing, but I don't know too much. Cause I wasn't really into it before. I'm just not a blood type of person. Like, I get very sick and icky with that, but I don't know. So now I be speaking to my mother about it. You know, now she happy. Or she was happy whether if I wanted to do something else in life, it didn't really matter. But because I'm now like kind of like following her footsteps and I'm attending the same school that she had went to before, I never even knew that she went to that school. So it's just like, wow, like I'm really following after my mother's footsteps. Ooh, and my, me and my uniforms and stuff, like I'm ready. Y'all gonna be seeing Nurse John A and everything. Like, ah, I'm geek. I'm really geek. 
I'm happy, but I'm also nervous because I heard nursing is very hard and stuff. And I heard that like, it comes with like some days where you're going to doubt yourself or, you know, you're just going to be feeling like, oh my God, I want to give up and everything. But I know me, I'm, I'm not going to give up. Definitely not. And my man is not going to let me give up anyway. He's going to be like, bro, push yourself. Right, I'm going to get back to y'all later when we're on our way to Walmart. Okay, y'all. So, I'm now leaving Walmart. But I literally forgot to vlog while I was in Walmart uh, grabbing the stuff that I need. Because my mother ended up meeting us at Walmart. And then I also had my sister. And I'm like, as soon as we left, then I'm like, dang, I didn't even freaking vlog so I'm just gonna I'm just gonna do a, a, a haul instead because um didn't get a chance to vlog inside um, Walmart so push the thing back and then pull it out and then um I don't even know what I was saying because you're making me lose focus I'm about to take my sister home and then I'm about to go home. Push it all the way in and then pull it. It was all the way in. We're in the car and now we're about to head back. So actually my school just called me, you know, to tell me that orientation is Monday. I'm excited. Like I just, I know. I just can't believe I really like, going back to school like i love school i'm such a nerd if anybody knows me such a huge nerd a higher education is good for me because of course i want to better myself at everything and that's my plans to better myself and you know succeed and I'm definitely gonna do that. Definitely. I don't know. When I was talking to people about me going back to school, like people just kept asking me what I would be interested in um, when I do nursing. And honestly, I was gonna go for the whole CNA thing, but talking to uh, like, I would say, I think she's like a counselor or something. She was like, don't do CNA. Um, because they they get paid the lowest or something and she was like you want something that you're gonna be you know proud to do and all this other stuff you know like really speaking like life into me like knowing how i am and what i want so it was just like you know what so that's why the program that i'm doing is like a nine month program so i get to do like different uh things and all of that which should be cool. I'm a little nervous about it, but I feel like I got this. Like, yeah, I feel like I got this and I'm gonna do good. Mm. I had a choice to either do the three months or the nine months, but I chose nine months, get better uh, experience and stuff. And probably would like be able to do more and no more but yeah y'all so now we heading back home i'm actually hungry but i'm not gonna go to applebee's or anything i'm just gonna eat a, a home cooked meal or something at home i'm trying to save money save 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 because the way things is looking I don't have time to just keep spending money and all of that. Like, I don't got it like that. It's sad. Cause I'm not used to that. Like, I'm not used to not having money to like buy food or like pamper myself and everything. Like, th all of this is new to me, but it's definitely have like humbled me and stuff, I would say. But I will hope to never get back in this uh, predicament where 
I feel like I'm living from paycheck to paycheck, if that makes sense. Like, I don't, nobody wants to live from paycheck to paycheck. It's, it sucks so bad. So, so bad. Like, my time is coming. I won't be like this for long. You know, I've just been staying focused. Not really going out and spending, like, money on useless things. Like, actually having my head like where I need to be and that's basically how I'm looking at everything now like I can't keep wasting money on stuff that I don't need so, I've been budgeting myself a lot lately it sucks but it's something I have to do so once we get to the house I'm gonna do a little haul for y'all to show y'all what I got since I couldn't well since I forgot to vlog while I was in Walmart I don't know how did I do that I think when I was speaking to my mother and then I also had my sister with me I forgot the phone my other phone in the car so I forgot to vlog okay y'all so I'm back in the house um let me show y'all what I got from Walmart yeah, I'm feeling myself. Y'all see me? You know? But anyway, so I had got me a, a five-star notebooks. They actually my favorite notebooks ever. And guess what, y'all? Y'all know how these books, notebooks be so expensive? They was only 97 cents just for this. Just for this. Like, a five-star subject notebook. 97 cents. I had got two of them, so you can't go wrong with 97 cents. And like I said, I'm on a budget, so then I had got me a, a planner for school so I could keep track of um, classwork is due and uh, when a classwork is due and stuff. And you know, because I heard like with nursing, it's a lot, so you're gonna have to track everything. so usually put all like anything that's due or a reminder sign on my phone for me to remember but i'm just make have a plan this so this is what i have right here then i got me some pens uh, uh, yeah so i also had got some pens um they were cheap just regular pens and I got some highlights because me when I take notes I like I like to see colorful stuff like that's what helped me like study and everything like I study notes like different from everybody then I also had got me some colorful pens as well because like I said I like to use color when I use notes and stuff and it will also help me like because if I like because like I said I know how to draw so if I need to draw something to help me demonstrate I can use the color pens to help me you know study more and know what i need to be known but yeah that's basically my little haul like i got school school start monday so this is just something for right now um i guess when monday come they'll probably tell me what else i need for school but right now this is all i have um what else oh i have order more masks and stuff because i have to wear masks at school and i'll have no more masks i usually carry them in my uh truck um then I had also got a book bag, a little cheap book bag, nothing too crazy, a little cheap. And I had ordered like some scrubs and stuff for, cause the first week we're not gonna wear like our scrubs, but then the second week we are gonna be wearing scrubs. So I just started like getting me some scrubs from Amazon, like cheap. So I ordered like, you you know you know my favorite color is purple, so I ordered a purple scrub. And a purple book bag. I hope y'all can see. And then from Kali uh, so why not? But yeah, that's all. All that stuff is coming before I come to school anyway. So, um, so excited! Oh my God, I'm really about to be a school girl with me. And y'all about to come with me on this long journey. My ups and downs, my accomplishments and everything. Um, 
I'm about to clean up Araya's playroom because she dirty did. This she go right there. I had bought that book from Walmart because that's what she picked out. That's what she wanted. I'm about to pick a uh, clean up her room. I think I'm gonna just take y'all with me to clean her room. Oh, y'all know I gotta do the hair cam. So let me show y'all my hair. So this is your girl hair. Long, natural, glorious. Love it. Got some body to it. Yes, ma'am. And it's so long, y'all. <laughs> Yeah, so this is Araya's playroom. Yes. Tore it up. Araya. Yes, so I'm about to clean this up and y'all about to watch me clean this room up. Okay, so I finished Araya's playroom. Look better than it did before, even though she's gonna mess it up uh, later. But this is the finishing uh, product now. I'm gonna close the door. Araya crying right now, and that's basically the end of my vlog. Like I said, it's just something short, something simple. I just wanted to tell y'all about my new journey and what I plan on doing now and I'ma have more content coming in and you know expect uh more videos getting deep into what I wanna do and what I'm doing and what I'm accomplishing accomplishing in but this was today's vlog and now we're just about to chill and relax and eat and then i will see you guys on my next vlog until then like comment and subscribe to my channel it so bye